Griffin Taboo. Taboo. Hello everyone, and welcome back to Sims 4, the Green Family Legacy, where we are currently practicing some method acting! Yes, some method acting, my friends, because Gene is getting ready for his very first ever proper acting job. And he's actually super excited about it because there's something about Gene that really just wants to take to the silver screen. He loves being friendly. He is just such the personality that loves when everybody is happy and he's the center of attention in a good way. He's not super egotistical at all, but he just loves being able to make a ton of people happy. And he's also really hopeful that maybe, just maybe, if he really lands this big acting gig, he'll be able to bring home thousands of simoleons and show that he can actually be a provider, which is one of the things that he wants to achieve in order to really show Fern that he's serious about making a family with her. No, Prince! Prince the bunny has passed away! Oh, that's so sad! Oh my gosh! All right, well, we'll think about that in a little bit. Like, the world goes on. The other stories of the small creatures and the sims around us continue to play out. But today's focus is going to be all about Gene and all about him trying to continue working on uh, this acting gig. And we're doing method acting because he actually has the Dead Sea Adventures tonight. And he is going to be a pirate. So one of his things he needed to do was develop his fitness skill. So he figured, what better way to do that than die? into the waters and really push himself to see what it would be like to be a pirate out on the open sea. If I could, he would totally spend some time playing with some kids uh, at that like pirate ship thing. In fact, I wonder if I can find some village kids at a park and just kind of throw everybody together because Jean totally would come over here to this park and just like meet with some of the village kids and just have a good time playing with them. But they're probably at school right now anyway. And meanwhile, over back at home, it looks like Fern has gone ahead and she is cleaning up the house. She's just been in a huge mood to like clean and tidy things lately. Uh, oh, good, and Patchy woke up, wonderful. This was full of all sorts of weeds a minute ago, but it looks like Patchy took care of everything. But Fern has some great news. Oh my gosh, and Toby, Toby, are you filthy again? <laughs> all right, Toby, let's go ahead and give you a treat. And then we're gonna go ahead and give Toby a bath because he needs it. Somehow he managed to get himself filthy yet again. Oh, our beloved Toby, it's bath time. But meanwhile, Fern has been having, oh my gosh, I didn't notice there was a gnome in that picture with Aspen, that's adorable. But Fern has been having a great time. What was that? Was it another animal died? Like I said, the small stories of the animals passing away apparently is happening everywhere too. Oh my gosh, are we really going to be able to bathe Toby in the downstairs bathtub for once? <gasps> is the downstairs bathtub fixed? Rooster Chick is thinking of leaving due to inadequate care. What? Also, when did we get a Rooster Chick? Oh my gosh. All right, well, we'll work on that in a little bit. And we can actually bathe Toby. Yes! <laughs> oh my gosh, sorry about that. I guess I must be allergic to the chickens or something. But this is great. Oh my gosh, because this tub used to be really broken and we'd have to go all the way upstairs to bathe Toby, so that makes me very happy. But anyway, in other news, Fern has some exciting news because she has actually gotten to the next level of the country caretaker! Huzzah! 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 She made enough animal traits that now I think this is the last level before we unlock the nature conservationist trait. And I looked again at the nature conservationist trait and if we can unlock it for her, her, animals will live longer and happier lives, which uh, means hopefully, you know, our chickens will stop trying to run away, especially when they're just baby chicks. And then she also can get more gifts from the birds and the rabbits, which would be really cool. But I'm really excited about this idea of her interacting with plants in unique ways. And when I tried to do some research about what that meant, apparently she gets higher yields on harvest from plants, which would be really cool. Really cool. And also free grocery delivery, which I guess is okay. Uh, but she's done a great job working on that. And she is continuing to work as a design guru. For some reason, she just always struggles with work performance, just like her dad. I might have to go ahead and spend some aspiration points 
<laughs> on like her doing better at work at some point, maybe entrepreneurial. Like, wait, she already has that, <laughs> and she still has terrible performance. Anyway, she's going to be uh, working on this later for sure. Uh, but Fern created something special, you guys. Look at this. I know we need to focus on Jean today, but I just wanted to say I'm so excited that we are actually able to make flower bouquets from the Wedding Stories pack, which I have heard a ton of dispersive opinions about, and I have no opinion about the wedding pack. I'm not encouraging people to get it. I'm just really happy I have more flowers. Then I also have a fun little plot in mind that I'm really looking forward to using Tortosa for. You guys will see, it's not going to be what you think because Fern and Jean are already married. So it'll be fun. It'll be quite fun. Uh, but Fern actually made this bouquet and I'm going to say she was just kind of making it as a smaller version of the vases that she creates out of a bunch of daisies. And she can do a bouquet throw. She can hold the bouquet and just carry it around all day long if we wanted to. I really hope children can do that because that would be so freaking cute. But she can also transform it. So we're going to transform it later and see what she can turn it into. But like I said, right now, today, we are all about Mr. Jean. All right, Jean. Oh, Jean, your bladder went up while you were swimming, you naughty. Oh my gosh, honestly, these Sims. All right, well, we don't want him to get too tired before it is time for him to go ahead. And actually, oh, is this a celebrity? This is a celebrity. There's just like a random celebrity walking down here. I, I, you know what? Let's just have Jean go ahead, hug fan, ask to take picture, sign autograph, celebrity, ask to bad mouth. Oh my gosh. So what? There's just a random celebrity here. Maybe it's because they're doing filming in Hinford on Bagley. Um, all right. Take selfie with fan. Offer to make over. <gasps> I would totally offer to make him over. Make him look like a pirate. Huh? Okay, uh, let's sign an autograph and see if we can build a relationship with them. Because one of the things Jean wanted to do was perform an acting scene. And I was going to have him maybe work on that somehow. Uh, hello, random celebrity Sim. Are you going to, like, stop? Can we, like, ask for a hug? Are we being just, like, ignored? How rude. <laughs> Secretly relieved from being an ocean. Oh my gosh, Jean. All right, whatever. Look, I don't have time for your nonsense, dude. What is with this? <gasps> Look at this harvest of mushrooms. I had no idea that there was just this gigantic pile of strange mushrooms down here. Oh, like, okay, Jean's going to go ahead and pick a couple of those because he knows Fern would really, really appreciate that. Um, and give a street performance. So perform any available of the available acting scenes away from the studio by clicking on your sim or another and selecting perform scene or perform scene for tips interaction. All right, we got some spicy mushrooms. We got some verdant mushrooms. We got some charming mushrooms. We'll give those to our lovely, lovely white or like actually wife. Yeah, now that I think about it. Perform romance scene with this random guy. Oh my gosh. All right. You know what? Uh, let's have Gene. He's just going to come over here. And he does want to go ahead and perform any acting scene. Gather roaming chickens. I didn't know that was a thing I could do. Man, you really have to work hard not to be distracted by the chaos that is the wonders of what you can be doing in a Sims world. Um, let's see. Shot forbidden words. Pose for pictures. Go jogging. So... Can I do anything here? I don't want to be gross actions. Okay, so I think I need a friend to be able to perform an acting scene with. So let's come over. And we also wanted to play soccer a minute ago. All right, let's ask about career. Just this random guy. I'm going to say the guy started it first. Like, what are you doing out here, son? Hey, so -so. <laughs> just swimming on a random day like this? All right, so this is Dominique Brumfield. I like not having uh, headlines on, so I don't know who's who or what's what until or perform scene. Oh my gosh, ah, we could perform a romance know. scene with him. That's funny. Yeah, Wait, course. he's a ufologist? <laughs> what? Hold up here. So he's actually a scientist searching for UFOs. Living Here I was ready for him to be just like some sort of country guy. And instead, he science. actually is a it's scientist who researches like alien <laughs> civilizations. That's kind of amazing. 
All right, let's get to know him. Just out of the blue. And then let's perform romance scene for tips, because Jean's, he's totally focused on trying to practice. Street performance. Hmm. Yeah, because that might let him get master actor today, which would be amazing. All right, what is he? Oh, and he's feeling a little vain. We learned Dominique loves the outdoors. All right, this this should be kind of funny. <laughs> oh my gosh, Gene. I love how he just walked up to this random guy and he's like, Gene! <laughs> okay, I kind of knew what was going to happen, but I didn't know what was going to happen. And I don't think Dominique knew what was going to happen when he just had this random guy walk up and be like, Can, can I help you? Can I can I can I practice my my scene for my acting show later tonight? Oh, that's so hilarious! Oh my gosh, I just cannot laugh hard enough about that. That is so funny. Now he's feeling flirty and he wants to send a flirty text and take the dog on a walk and try for a baby with fern. All right, that's too funny. And Dominique's out of here. That was probably a little much for him. All right, who's this? Let's see. Krista, so let's do cheerful introduction. She too is a celebrity. She's also dazed. What is with everybody being dazed lately? Oh, we know Christina. She's a proper celebrity. I imagine, again, she's probably here because of all of the, the acting they're going to be doing. Who's calling Fern? It's her mom. All right, we'll, we'll go ahead. We'll let them chat. And meanwhile... All right, Fern really, or Jean really wants to probably go home because he wants to go kiss somebody now. So I think we'll go ahead and just have enthuse about acting and then maybe ask about career just to see what the heck. And she's gone too. Everybody is so rude. All right, let's 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 have Jean start heading home. And meanwhile, Fern is on a phone call with her mom, Devin. Which is great, but Fern also has some work we need to do today. Oh, now who's calling Jean? I heard you and Owen Loin are good friends now. You're getting more popular. Clearly you're a good person to know. That's great. Jeez, everybody is just suddenly calling. We need to submit an eco-invention concept with Fern. Devin has spread some juicy gossip about Iris. That's your, your dead grandma. Like, don't... Oh my gosh, whatever. I can't believe these people sometimes. All right, and meanwhile, oh, this thing broke and Patchy's fixing it. Patchy, you're a real, like, bro of a skeleton. Uh, meanwhile, let's come over and, oh, there's a new bunny. Okay, we're just going to go ahead and let that bunny be named Daisy. All right, what should I do? Let, let's transform this thing to say that maybe Fern found a interesting way to use more of the plants that she's interacting oh with. Gosh, I love this little family. It's just chaos all the time. All right, what's this going to turn into? <gasps> what is this? Is that just a box of, like, Chinese food? Okay, that's hilarious. Come on, Fern. Flowers are better than that. And then I'm going to have her come over and work on repairing that. Oh, incoming phone call from Agatha. It's good to hear your voice, Fern. I wanted to ask if I should get to know Lloyd Barnes a little better as a friend. They seem like good company. I think you should go for it, to be honest. I'm not sure. Yeah, sure. Like, Fern would definitely encourage people to become friendly. All right, so I think we kind of miffed it on this adorable little wicker pot. At the same time, this wicker pot would be really cute to actually put some of those, like, daisies into. So I think we might go ahead and maybe see if we can merge the daisy bouquet into that pot later. But for now, Patchy's taking care of the plants. And Fern is going to go ahead. There we go. Upgrade parts, salvage parts. Let's scavenge for parts. Oh, and she needs to use the fabricator, so I'm going to have her come over. And I'm going to let her fabricate. Let's actually fabricate a bed. Because I'm curious to see if we can maybe transform that into something interesting. Also, is this another trash plant? Hmm. Maybe this time to turn testing cheats back on. And let's see. 
Headlines on. There we go. All right. Meanwhile, Gene, are you back home? He is. He's admiring his fine self. Oh my gosh, Gene. All right. He's probably going to actually be leaving soon for his work. So I'm going to let him grab some leftovers and then maybe come out and... He, well, Fern's already home, so he can't send a flirty text to her, but maybe come out and give her a hug before he goes to his big secret acting career that he's going to, to work on. I think Fern knows kind of that Jean is going to help somebody in town with some, some project they have, some like art project or documentary project. She's not really quite clear. Also, is my fabricator busted? Because it doesn't seem to be fabricating that single bed for me. There we go. All right, Jean, Ooh. eating down on the noms, that casserole that you enjoy. Toby's got enough food. When are we leaving for work? All right, let's clean up. Maybe I should, should I have him be like super confident? Maybe I should have him drink a coffee. Is there gonna be coffee? Hey. All right, Jean's gonna panic a little bit and I'm gonna have him take uh, a brisk shower, a thoughtful shower. Let's do a thoughtful shower. Because he's, I think he'd be distracted. I mean, this is his first acting thing. He's probably a little nervous. There's a lot to think about. Work starts for Jean in an hour. And interestingly enough, I think that the fabricator is currently busted. Because every time I work on things and then click away from our girl Fern, it stops working. There we go. All right. So now she's fabricated something from home and actually got some money because we're going to say... She's fabricating ideas to help out with her civic design career that we have now. And let's have her transform this, because I'm curious about it. All right, watch out, little bunny. In fact, I think I might... Oh, new bed! Yeah! All right, that's what I was hoping to see. Um, also, let's go ahead and pet the bunny real quick. So we just transformed this bed into a double futon that's worth 560 samoles. Not bad. I'm going to say that's Fern coming up with some ideas for how to help the city after all. And then I might have her put her fabricator away for a little while because she's going to need to work on other projects. All right, but Fern, you cuddle bunnies until Jean needs to leave for his work. I think he actually needs to be... This is a new unnamed wild rabbit. Favorite gift unknown. Let's give some produce. How about a nice, wonderful blackberry? And we'll gossip about the flower bunny for a little while. And then Fern... Oh, let's go, let's go, let's go! Well, Fern is cuddling bunnies, it is finally time. Jean has been spending time in the water all day. Thinking about being a pirate, we had that unexpected romance scene that he practiced because he's just pouncing anybody. Like, I've got to remember my lines. And now, after a very, very, very long time, we're going to go ahead and we're going to actually see if I can remember how to do any acting. It's literally been years now. <laughs> All right. Jean, it's all about you, my friend! So get into hair and makeup. Earn gold on this performance is one of the big things he wants to do. Practice acting, acting gossip with somebody on set, get into hair and makeup. All right. We're going to have him, like, move, move, move at this. All right, let's go to costume for gig first. Even though he can be surprisingly easily distractible, I think our boy Jean... He's inspired, he's excited. The workday ends at 4 a.m. Look at this, it's his first time on set, how fun. As time goes on, we might even edit this lot if Gene can bring a little bit of his genisms to the whole situation. I could totally see him like convincing everybody to change things up a little bit. The wardrobe stylist, Fatia. Hi! Jean, it's finally time! Oh my gosh! Hopefully this will go well. She seems like she knows what she's doing. <gasps> he's so cute! Look at Eugene! Oh my gosh, he's gonna be oh, an actor. This is so cool. Alright, he totally would talk to everybody on the way here too. Uh, does he have celebrity? Oh, he does ask to praise. So we could have her praise people. Alright, he totally would like 
uh, enthused about acting. And then go ahead and get to know. Ah. <laughs> She's like, look, kid. Once you've worked here as long as I have, you're not that... She doesn't seem to be into acting. So I think she's probably seen it all. Oh, and she's self-absorbed? That's so funny. Uh, let's see. We'll try brightening her day, maybe. Yeah, she seems to have really refined taste. And then let's go ahead and flatter her, because that's totally the Jean way of doing things. And then we need to gossip with someone on set. So I wonder if this counts. So hang on one second. All right, she's she's happy now. She's like, hey, this kid isn't so bad. Um, flatter. Okay, is this is this does this work? Oh my gosh, that's like some juicy gossip, Jean. Oh, Levine. <laughs> all right and oh that actually did count okay so now we're gonna come on over and let's go ahead and get our hair done so we've got hair and makeup done this poor woman what a boring room to work in jean's gonna resolve to like bring her <laughs> some music to listen to and some cool things that they can actually do Oh, how cute would it be uh, is if day. every successful acting job we have, we go ahead and maybe like add in some nautical themes if it was like the nautical theme stuff. Oh, Jean. Making that million dollar smile. Even fancier. Oh my gosh. That's really cool. It's been a very long time since I've done this, so I totally forgot that he could have like a different face. Ah, sorry about the walls. His hair is already perfect, if you ask me, ma'am. Don't mess with perfection. She messed with perfection! And it actually turned out really great! I don't even recognize you anymore, Jean! What? <laughs> Alright, tell the director we're ready. Practice acting. So this is Kyoko Kowabashi. I, I believe, uh, and let's go ahead, let's enthuse about acting, and then ask her about her career. She seems more practical, she just wants to go ahead and sit down. And then we'll get to know for a quick second. And you know what, maybe we'll even give her a gift. Can I give her a gift real quick? Give gift. Friendly gift. Um, what do we have? An orange bell pepper? What do we have that we could offer that Jean would be like, this is fine. Um, let's see. Spicy mushroom conserve. Why not? <laughs> All right, offer it up, Jean. Don't take too long about this. Jean has learned that she's the makeup artist at the crew, and she's self-assured but not self-absorbed. Or maybe the other one was self-assured as well. Everybody is really self-assured. She's feeling a little tense. There, maybe that gift will help. Oh, she feels really happy about that, I think. All right, so let's practice acting for a second. All right, so she's tense about how the day will go. And we're getting tired. Oh my gosh, that is not acceptable. Is there coffee here? Wait, oh, the tool has gotten so many updates. All right, how to make this active. Are you telling me this thing won't work? Oh, come on, that's just ridiculous. There we go. All right. Sorry about that, guys. This is going to be a ridiculously, ridiculously long episode now. But now we can go ahead and we can just get ourselves a, like, coffee. <laughs> because this that's ridiculous. All right. Maybe we're going to be lucky. And while Gene's working on his acting skill, I am so offended that you can't have food trucks out here. All right. So now Gene needs to be funny on set and eat some food. So let's let him come over and maybe start working with some of the co-actors because it looks like she's going to be in it background actor right here sachi all right meanwhile look at that we've got our coffee that's more how things should go now we're feeling energized so let's come over let's cheerful introduce ourselves to this background actor and then we'll go ahead and try being funny with her for a little while all right come on Jean well we just became good friends with her just like that <laughs> is that because of our cheerful introduction Jean oh my gosh I forgot how he just does not like wait he just immediately tries to become friends with people all right Jean let's go ahead and joke about the fashion that you guys are wearing real quick 
We'll have a quick bite to eat, just to stave away being too hungry. Chips and salsa should be good. We'll grab a serving of the chips and salsa. There we go. I don't think he's terribly hungry, but then we'll go ahead and tell our knock-knock joke. Or joke about fashion. Everybody seems really tense. Alright, there we go. Be funny on set. Excellent. Alright, I think we're ready to go, guys! Oh, Gene! Oh, he wants to check his... Ref he wants to look in the mirror just really quickly. Uh, it, let's let him admire his fine self, because that might actually help him out. And then we need to find the director. I don't know who Irkham is, but I wish him well. Everybody's feeling paranoid and confused. Is this the director? This is the director. All right, let's come over and we'll do a cheerful introduction with her next. All right, Jean's feeling good. Feeling good. Let's do this. This is already going to be a very, very long episode. Sorry about that, guys. Didn't notice. Fern, for crying out loud, are you not to, are you not asleep? Yep. Yeah. All right, cheerful introduction to the director. Oh, we just immediately became good friends with her <laughs> and gained a great reputation. Jean, you are just like laying in on people. So, wow, like best, best friends. What is this? Did you see his reputation? Oh my gosh, where is his reputation? It's just like pristine. It's the most perfect reputation ever. All right, can we tell her? Uh, tell director ready to perform. All right, let's do this. All right, there's the set. Is it gonna light up now that we're ready? <gasps> oh, look at it! Cool! Perform ship scene, perform flirt scene, perform fight scene. All right, let's do... Um, his. What is his acting skill at? Four. So we might play it kind of safe. All right, safe flirt, risky sword fight. Let's do a safe wheel turn just to kind of get things up and going. Hello, fellow actors. Oh my gosh, this is so cute. Hang in there, Jean. Get gold, okay? <laughs> okay, he looks like he's having a good time. Did that count? Let's see. Select the glowing and select will turn. All right. I could have sworn. Oh my gosh, we keep wanting to kick. Okay, if we keep getting interrupted by wanting to kick that soccer ball, I am going to get rid of that soccer ball. All right, there we go. Now he managed to perform it in time. All right, let's come down and we'll do the flirt next. Um, let's do a risky flirt because I think Gene's going to be getting a little bit of his nerves out of the way. I think we're close to gold anyway. <gasps> All right, good luck, Jean. She's not very good at this, I think. But she is a co-worker. A notable newcomer. Yay! All right. Well, let's go ahead and compliment her, like, with a cheerful introduction. And Vanessa, huh? So as a newcomer, I think that she's... Oh my gosh, and now we just became good friends with her too? Why? Jean, you're so overpowered, I swear. All right, and meanwhile, do we want to do a normal or a risky sword fight? <sighs> Let me think. His fitness is only level four, so and I think he, he'd be feeling like a little tired and really wanting to make sure like he gets home to Fern safely. So, Jean, stop chatting. I think that would be the one thing everybody would say is that he's a bit of a chatterbug. <sighs> All right, let's do a safe sword fight. Cute! Good job! Wait, vampire bite scene! Oh my gosh! Okay, let's do a risky bite then. I didn't know we were gonna have a vampire. Oh, she's a really a vampire! What? Okay, that was a funny twist. I didn't see that coming. It must be the twist in the episode. Wait, we're the vampire? Oh my gosh. Okay, that's hilarious. 
Hey, we did it! And it was gold! Yes! Oh my gosh, that's really funny. Okay, let's go ahead. We'll do one more cheerful introduction. But you guys, I think Gene did a, a great job, even though he's kind of... No, okay, we're a little flirty on this end. Don't need flirtiness here. However, let's go ahead. Now that Gene's ready to... Gene Jewel has seven... Oh, seven minutes left in his workday? All right, that's no time at all. All right, let's come on down. Maybe it will, he's going to try to become a little bit... A little bit more friendly. Stationary camera operator. We did it! Gene got gold. That's a wrap. Gene has finished all of his scenes. The crew is shutting down and the footage is being sent to editing. Oh my gosh, you guys. So he gained a bit of fame, I think. Let's check it out. He's promoted to Rising Star. <gasps> yes, okay. And then we need to get gold in a commercial acting gig. Got it. So we actually need to do a commercial acting gig. But we did it. So rising star already. Good job, Gene. Good job. Ideal mood confident. We'll get there. But alright guys, thank you so much for joining us on Jean's adventure here. If you guys could, do please leave a like for our wonderful man of the million dollar smile. And if you'd like to join us on this and literally thousands more adventures, do please consider subscribing. But most importantly, stay curious. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye bye